Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, today the Lord is calling us to reflect on the first reading from the book of Numbers, chapter 11, verse 4b to 15. In these particular verses, we see the people of Israel coming to Moses, complaining on whatever is happening. They are telling him that you've taken us out from the land of Egypt, where we had enough food to eat, where we had enough meat, where we had enough vegetables. But here in the wilderness, we are suffering, we are starving, we have nothing to eat. Then Moses is turning back to God. He's tired. He's saying, God, what is this? You have told me to take these people from the land of Egypt. Did you want me to carry these people alone? Now I can no longer take it on my own. It's either you take this suffering or I die. My dear brothers and sisters, today Moses is showing us another side where we have to turn back to God whenever we run short of words in prayer. Because sometimes when we pray, we feel that words are no longer coming out or words are no longer expressing our emotions and feelings. That is where we have to turn back to God and speak to Him, talk to Him and tell Him your problems. Tell Him whatever is troubling you. Tell Him whatever is happening in your life. He might change your situation. Tell Him that, God, I've been, I've been suffering for so many years. This is the problem I have. Take it away from me. I can no longer take it. This is the God who is always responding. This is the God who turned back and see what was happening with Moses and said, no, this is not the right way. This is not how you were supposed to carry the people of Israel. Now I'm going to change and turn the things. We are also called, we are also called, my dear brothers and sisters, to tell the Lord whatever is troubling us, to tell him everything coming from our hearts, that is why Jesus said, I have called you friends. When you have a friend, it's someone with whom you talk to. You tell him whatever your problem is. You tell the person whatever is troubling you. That is how we have to, to tell Jesus. That is how we have to bring our problems to Jesus. Tell him that God, it is over my power. I can no longer do it. Take it over from here. 